Welcome to Canada in the dead of winter. I have had this day in my calendar for many months. Today was to be a man versus nature moment. Today, I was to hit and then master the snowy slopes of the true north strong and free. Nature is not cooperating. No snow, no sun, no slopes, no problem. Welcome to Vaughan, Ontario. This week, the Mercer Report tackles the great indoors. This is Simon Chang. He is one of the founders of Axis Freestyle Academy. Hello, Simon. How are you? Good. How are you doing? Very good. Thank you for having me here. So this is all about skiing and snowboarding indoors, eh? Yes, that's correct. People who like love being on the hills, they can come here in the summer, they can come here in the fall. Yes. What about people like me who um, have no skills, no athletic ability, who've gone out there on the big slopes and it's intimidating and you kind of hurt yourself? Is it a good thing for people like me? Yes, definitely, because okay. we have a slope that's modular, so we can take all our features off, arrange yeah. them for beginners up to advanced riders, uh -huh. and basically that allows everyone to learn. Hello, this is Adam. Adam is another one of the partners. Hello, Adam. How you doing? What is this carpet? It's uh, basically... My mother had this carpet. <laughs> it's an AstroTurf. It's, a, it's similar to what you would see at uh, like a golf dome. Okay, now I'm going to soap down the hill. And that's not a euphemism. That's really what I'm doing. Yeah, right? that's exactly this what you're doing. This is soap and water. Now this is the only one of these facilities in Canada. That's our first first one in Canada. Oh, wait, are you first one? Do you have big plans uh, to open these all over the place? Yeah, eventually. That's kind of like where we would like to move to one day. So I'm gonna, I'm gonna do one more soak myself okay, just to do it. make sure it's, it's okay. So the soapy carpet thing is real. It's legit, Rick. Okay, now I can't go on a rail. No, but we can get you going down the hill first. Yeah? Do you think skiing will ever be an Olympic sport? <laughs> I'm pretty sure it is, Rick. <laughs> <laughs> he asked such penetrating questions. Carpet man! Okay. Woo. Oh. That's what you call a dignified uh, landing right there. Uh, you were pretty steezy out there. Right. What's that mean? Steezy is a term that they kind of throw around. It's just like swagger, look really good. I was steezy. You were. Rolling on his phone. <laughs> Kids rolling on it. He's on Snapchat, taking yeah. selfies. Say hi to all the people watching live. Yeah, all the hi. people watching live on Instagram. Is it like yeah. Facebook Live? Yeah, kind of. But it's Instagram. And, yeah. And you just broadcast yourself going down the hill and doing an amazing jump? Yeah, all these people are watching. How many people do we have, Ryan? We have five, six right now. We have six viewers! Six viewers! This is the future! Nice. I hope the head of the CBC is not watching this. They'll be going, hmm, six viewers. What are they saying now? Uh, they're saying, is that Rick Mercer? Yes, it is, Max. Yeah. It is Tell Max. Tell him I'm really tall. He's really, he, he's really tall, actually, though. Yeah. Do Five. they know who I am? How old are they? Oh, uh, they're about like 12, 13. I'm gonna work forever. Okay. Okay. I'm bye. Do some ski tricks now. Okay, you do some ski tricks. Awesome. That was like a Freedom 55 commercial. <laughs> Jake Holden, professional snowboarder, represented Canada in 2014 at the Sochi Olympics. Hello, Jake, how are you? Good, thanks, how are you? Wow, imagine bumping into you here. Now, you're a big snowboarder. You probably snowboarded all over the world, right? I did, yes, yeah. indeed. Living the dream. Living the dream. Have you ever snowboarded indoors? Never. 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 Heard about it, seen it, but never tried. Never even like in a hotel down the stairs or anything like that? Okay, well maybe I got a few stories. I knew that. Have you ever seen a launcher before? No, this this caught my eye before It's the got only it. one in Canada. Yeah. I'm kind of excited about this because it seems dumb. And I, it appeals to me on that level, but I realize it's a professional tool uh, to help young snowboarders reach their dreams. 
but I just think it'll be fun. Okay, this is Mikkel. Hello, how are you? Nice to meet you, sir. Good to see you. You are our our test hamster, as it. You could say that. Yeah. Yeah. Crash yeah. test hamster dummy thing. You are gonna do great, and I'm gonna come over here as we speak. Donald Trump is about to do the exact same thing I'm about to do. Look at this. A key and a red button. So the red button is emergency stop. You don't want to touch that. Unless don't it's never touch the stop button. Wow! So you up first or what? No. No. <laughs> you're the professional. Rock, paper, scissors, best two no, out of three. You're the, you're the professional. How was it? That was a lot of fun. Really? You'd do it again? Oh, yeah. See, I'm getting nervous over and now. Over again. I'm getting nervous now because watching you, you had form. And form seems like it's important. You won't hit the bag when we, when we go off. Why won't I hit the bag? Because we're going at only 15. At 15 miles an hour, we only get up to a little bit up, up, the, up the ramp. So I'm not going into the bag. I've psyched myself up to go into the bag. So where am I going? So you'll go, basically, you'll go up the ramp and just slide right back down. Backwards? Backwards. <laughs> and that's better? That's the Put me into the step. ramp. Into the bag? Into the bag. Launch! wild world of sports moment right there. I didn't let go. <sighs> How stupid, I only had to remember two things. You're jumping the gun. I know. Okay, this time I let go. <laughs> Play hard, land soft. Axis Freestyle Academy. Now I'm just gonna lie down for a bit. And then I'll do it again!